What's up viewers? Well, this is your host Abbas bringing yet another movie review and this one is on Commando 2 and it has been brought to you by Foamy Fanatic. Well, today uh, I was very excited. It was a very good day for me because we had not one but two movies releasing. Both were action based movies. One was a superhero action movie and the second one was suspense and action thriller movie. Uh, one was of, from Hollywood and uh, that was Logan for which I've already given the review. If you have not watched the video, just go and watch the video at, from the link at the end of this video. So watch this one first and then go to Logan. Uh, and the best thing was both the movies were actually sequels to some like, you know already existing movie storylines or movie franchises. So it was a sequel Friday, that's what I'll call, that's what I'll remember this as. But yes, uh, let's not waste much time and, and let's get on to the movie review. Well, uh, when Commando 1 had released, uh, it, it was a very good movie, like you know, it was appreciated for the action scenes and for the insane level of stunts that were performed by Vidyut Jamal, uh, which no other Bollywood actor could have done at that point of time. Well, yes, um, Commando 1 had the, uh, like you know, had, had the the entire story like the plot was revolving around the action sequences I mean uh, the movie was good the action sequences uh, were quite good but there was no plot in the first movie and the supporting roles were also like you know there were very few characters in the movie but when it comes to Commando 2 and yes uh, firstly the director of this movie is uh, Devin Bhujani it, uh, it is his directorial debut and you can say that yes uh, he has done a good job. The first half of the movie was quite good. Uh, actually, when I went to watch this movie, uh, I was uh, hoping that it will be an advanced version or it will be an upgraded version of Commando 1. I just went there to see the action sequences because we don't get to see these kind of action scenes uh, in Bollywood uh, over the recent times because the, like, you know, not a lot of directors are making that kind of movies. But yes, it was fresh, it was good. I was surprised to find out that uh, the action uh, was not the base of the storyline, was not the base of the movie. It was a mixture of action and suspense and uh, it was very well told in the first half. Well, we get to see a lot of action in the first half and then we get to see the suspense part, uh, a little bit of action sprinkled here and there. Then we see the second half which is so full of twists and turns which was not required, I mean that many twists and turns were not required and in the towards the end we again get to see a lot of action scenes. Well, uh, what you can feel, uh, like uh, what I felt is the first part was good, it was interesting but when it came to the second half of the movie it was uh, like you know, it, it became overcooked I can say because uh, there, were, there were so many twists, there were so many climaxes or anti-climaxes that you just get irritated after a point of time and for you the story becomes dragging the movie becomes dragging uh, coming over to the star cast well uh, the star cast included Vidyat Jamwal uh, experienced and veteran I would say actor Radhi Agnihotri was acted in a lot of movies earlier we also get to see Freddy Darwala and this time as a good guy because we uh, I, as far as I remember last time I saw him in Holiday as the bad guy well, we have two gorgeous actresses. One is uh, Isha Gupta. I, I, I feel that Isha Gupta is one of the hottest actresses in this time. But, and then we also have Ada Sharma. The best thing is, the director in this movie chooses not to use the sensuality of the leading ladies and keep it at a graceful level only. And like you know restrict the movie only to the action and suspense that's it nothing else apart from that so we don't have any songs also in the movie which is also a surprising thing for me i was expecting a lot of songs in the movie well overall uh you, like you know you can go and watch the movie in the theaters if you're uh, a fan of those kind of movies which try to do something new in bollywood so go and watch this movie but uh, filmy fanatic rates this movie or i should say gives this movie a thumbs up but not a smile I would say like you know I, I would have given a smile if there were not so much of irritating plot twist in the second half of the movie 
So guys, uh, this was our movie review on uh, Commando 2. I hope that you like the video and yes, don't forget to share your thoughts in the comment section below and let us know what you think about this movie. Well, share the video, definitely. Sh uh, share the movie review on Logan and on Commando 2 with your friends before they catch these movies this weekend. See you guys in our next video. Till then, take care. Khuda Hafiz. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel that is Filming Fanatic.